you worried about your bike when it's in the office parking or below your building or you parked it somewhere in a mall and you're worried you know is your bike safe is someone going to you know uh, move your bike is someone going to shift your bike is your bike going to fall then this video is for you hey guys and welcome back to my channel mumbai car boy yes uh, welcome to this beautiful vlog i have installed this adjust uh, beautiful device it's an adjust safety device uh five months uh, from now if you've gone ahead and seen my installation video i'll put it on the i link right here so this video is going to tell you about all my personal experience and a custom review after installation of this adjust uh, safety device on my bike so talking about this device it is basically made in india that's the most uh, important thing of this device it's made in india yes you heard it right let's take you to the bike right now you can see this over here so this is the small device that we have installed this is just pretty much how much space as it takes uh, the connection everything you would get in the previous i link that i put up on the video go check it out you would see the entire installation of that uh, device uh, how it was installed and how easy it is to install on any bike so there is a dedicated app you know which you can get from the apple store or the google play store uh, which you can download and you know monitor this uh, beautiful app so let me take you to some of the features that are available on this uh, device it's like you ha have your fuel logs you can actually go ahead and check all the rides you have done you can play back rides that you have done there is also theft detection accident detection motion detection engine on and engine off that you can also monitor everything through this small little device and the app so it's time for me to share my personal experience with this device CS yes, after adding my family members so i have three members added uh, for notifications so in case i have an accident or in case the bike starts there's an engine alert uh, is there's, there's any motion detection these are the three people get that get notified that's my mom my girl and my sister definitely so what happens in this experience i'll tell you my personal experience that i've had so i my, i used to during the lockdown as well i used to go and get medicines for my mom so i used to travel from my place to andheri that's from khar to andheri and uh, when i was coming back so my mom used to ask me okay now how much do i have to pay you so i should give her the bill of the medicines and i was uh, to over and above you can pay me 200 bucks for the petrol so she was so smart enough and she was like uh, no but petrol was just 50 rupees and i was like how did she know then i realized that you know she's been smart enough and used the app and checked you know where am i riding where am i going to am i going directly to the store pharmacy or am i roaming gallivanting around so she used to actually monitor every ride so because what happens is when i turn the ignition off it buzzes in her phone so exactly that's exactly what i'm trying to say it buzzes in her phone and she gets a notification that the bike is now turned on so even if she's not at home she knows that I'm actually moved out of the house and she can see the fuel log. So over there, when you, uh, you know, go and play back your rides or once you finish your ride and you come home and then you get the notification that, you know, now the location of the bike is now turned black. Whereas if it's on, it's blue. So when it turns black and she knows, you know, I'm come home, she goes and opens the log and there she can see it right down there saying that, you know, the petrol fuel uh, consumption for this ride was just 20 or 30 rupees. And she's like, Take your 20 rupees and that's what you actually spent. So yes, it is It is also taken away my headache of, you know, reminding myself to always send her a location when I'm doing rides or where I have reached. Because every time initially before installing the adjust, I used, she used to remind me, send me your location, send me your location. So if I was traveling from here to Lonavla and whatever time I had to send, the loca send her the location for 8 hours, which is also draining my battery when I'm doing the ride, which is also at times I used to forget and then she should keep on calling where have you reached i'm worried i'm worried so that's the burden that this beautiful device has taken away from me so let me right now go ahead and share with you a few uh, you know features that have actually worked for me uh, so talking about motion detection so i was at work one day it was 8 pm and i was at work busy at work uh, suddenly my phone rang and i i could see that there was a motion detected on my bike now it actually scared me because I don't take this bike every day to work. I have another Thunderbird that I take to work and this bike was just parked below my building. So I immediately called my mom and asked her, my mom is, are you at home? She said, no, I'm not at home. Uh, I'm outside. So I just asked her, please, if you can rush home and see what has happened with the bike. If the children have actually sat on the bike or has someone moved the bike because, you know, they wanted to park the bike or is someone, you know, banged into my bike, please go ahead and check. 
so this act actually worked and then she actually went ahead and you know uh, phoned my neighbors to see if the bike was moved because she could not actually immediately go to that spot but that that's exactly how this uh, device works so it is also i have experienced it like for example giving me one more experience of mine i was actually during the rains right now i was coming back home and due to the mossy uh, uh, you know um, surface uh, on the road i slipped now when i slipped is my bike fell and i left my bike and the bike just fell and it, nothing happened to me i was not fast i just started the bike and i was trying to turn uh, towards the right and unfortunately i slipped now this the device actually notified my mom saying it was an accident uh, sensor so it, i detected it as an accident of course it was an accident and it was nice enough that you know i don't need to worry because my mom immediately called me it buzzed on her phone it buzzed on my sister's phone it bu buzzed on my girl's phone lucky that my girl was with me when this happened but my mom immediately called me and asked me how am i doing so just imagine if you really have an accident and you are actually fallen there down and no one knows what to do and they are asking you for your parents number or and then they see your mom actually calling at that point of time and they'll be like they'll be thinking oh my damn you are really lucky that your mom has called you at the right time but it is because of this beautiful device that your family gets notified as soon as you get meet with an accident actually and they are notified and so that they know okay they also know your exact location on the map you know i will show you the features of uh, the app later on on the phone and that is something nice you know so that they are alerted first they know what to do they know exactly what has happened is it a real accident it is uh, is it you've just uh, fallen or what has happened and they are the burden is over so now i'll i'll show you a screen of course i will show you a screen right here so what we're going to do is we're going to discuss show you a small a few features uh, that are main in this uh, app so let's go ahead and take you that over here right now you see it says mumbai car that's you can edit the profile it shows you a uh, few logs uh, you can share your location as i said also in case someone does not has have this adjust software because you are entitled to have four people that you can share this app and your password and they they can have access to the app in case there are a few ride riders who you want to share and this is interrupted uninterrupted so it can can be for a long uh, time it's just not have a limit of 1 hour or 8 hours till you do your ride they will be notified and of course help and session add more vehicles if you have more vehicles you can add them right there depending on the adjust uh, devices that you would need to buy for those vehicles but you can use it with one app so let's go ahead and see so that's basically uh, my page of course if you click on mumbai car boy it will give you my personal details my medical uh, information let's go back So this is right here. This is the first screen uh, that you see. That's the first uh, speedometer or tachometer emblem that you see right on the left below. So this is you see a black dot in the middle of the screen is basically uh, where the bike is right now, and it is uh, black because it is off. The second one that you see a zigzag route is basically all the rides that I've done. So yes, you can go ahead and play back your rides. Let me show you something right here. So this was a ride that I did on 29 uh, July. uh 20, 24th july sorry and over there you can see on the right hand says you see a petrol uh, uh sign it says 24 rupees petrol was used i did 7.2 kilometers on this ride which took around 26 uh, minutes and 23 seconds the average that i received uh, on this ride was uh, 16.3 kilometers per hour and of course the lean ratio was 35 so this is how the app looks the maximum speed that you can see right up on the left side it said i did a a max speed of 53.7 and this ride was at 238 pm that i did this ride so if you see this play button right here if you click on the play button it will exactly show you a playback of the entire ride so you can see it right now happening on the phone it is the playback that you can uh, it actually is doing uh of the right so in this case if you have to fool your mother and tell her you know i went somewhere else or you, you actually this is uh, for all those guys who are married who have girlfriends and tell them you know and if you share this you need to be very very sure of what you're telling them because they can actually see everything my girl exactly knows where i am and what she's like she asked me like oh are you at the pet store buying uh, food for thor and harley and i'm like yes oh then i remember yes yeah, she's actually tracking me down So that's basically how this is. Let's move to the next one. That is the graph. So over here you see for the month of July, so you can actually choose uh, 
what records you want as well so this is for the month of july i did a distance of 184 kilometers of course you cannot ride that's the only reason it's so less uh, ride durations of course you can see the ride durations for that particular day what were the ride durations that you did for example over here 29th i did 26 uh, meter uh, minutes uh, 26 july I did 20 minutes so and so forth you can check your rides right here the average speed that uh, that was 17.4 the fueling spend, uh, the fuel spending for that month of July, I spent 833 uh, rupees of fuel, and my lean ratio has been average has been 43. So over here you can see distance duration again. It shows a graph over here, and this bell icon is the most important thing that I was telling you about. That is your uh, what do you say? It is the motor, uh, motion uh, detection, the engine on, the accident detection notifications, all are over here. If you see there was a vibration sensed uh, on uh, 29 July at 2.49 uh, that was exactly what it was it was there was an en engine on on the 23rd of uh, July at so and so time that's at 12.59 the engine went on power of supply so this is when I was doing my work if you've seen my vlogs there was an issue with my bike I had to disconnect the battery uh, terminal so that's when it says power supply off as well so you know someone is actually tampering with your bike and you get a notification right there uh, engine off again uh, vehicle unreachable because of course I told you uh, this uh, was because of the battery removed but I'll share you some more information on that and det accident detected is basically yes that was when I shared with you when my bike fell off uh, when I slipped on the mosh uh, mass and I fell off that was basically uh, when it actually came up with that accident detection the next question that everyone has is you know does it drain off your battery so let me tell you one thing it does not drain out your battery because i've been uh, it's been installed in my bike from the last five months i've never had an issue with my battery but keep in mind you know the the device does run uh, on the back uh, ground it's because that's the only reason i initial my first experience which i shared with you the motion detection actually worked when my bike was shifted so it does really work at uh, the background it is a pretty small device as i said so that's one more benefit yes there is a, a clause in this now what happens is every year you have to renew the actual vodafone subscription because there is a sim card into it and of course very very important for you to make note is if you are in a village and you do not have proper network it could be an issue you know where your family would not get your it's basically like you sharing your whatsapp location and if you don't have proper network your your family does see you that you're still at kolapur but actually you've reached uh, on your way nepani that is between goa and uh, kolapur then they get connected is once the, you have proper network in goa they will again get connected and get notified that now you have reached goa but yes that could be a small uh, period where they are tense because they don't see you moving and they only see you stuck at one location you would expect calls i have received calls from my mom saying that why are you not moving now so <laughs> that's exactly how it is answering the most important question at this time is uh, how good is the customer service uh, for adjust team so let me share you one more experience of mine i had a calibration issue so when the bike used to lean a little on the left Yes, uh, it is to buzz and my mom used to get irritated, you know, every time initially that what happened, it is motion sensing the bike because once I put it on the stand, if there's any movement, so the bike has to be calibrated uh, initial uh, when installation, they do calibrate to the bike. But yes, there was an issue with my bike, but I was very happy when I called customer service for the adjust team. They were prompt enough. They went ahead and, you know, got it rectified. They sent a sales representative to come and actually check the bike, calibrated the bike. And it's pretty fine. I've never had an issue post that. The issue that someone could face is uh, depending, depending on your location, uh, adjust team uh, offers you either Vodafone or Airtel SIM card. So if you have a very good signal strength of Vodafone, off for the Vodafone SIM card. Or if you have a uh, good strength for Airtel, give them the information and opt for the Airtel uh, SIM card as well. So this is in this way, you have proper service of the entire device and your app and stuff also are, uh, you know, go in sync with your rides. So now it's time to answer most of your guys question. Yes, uh, the first thing is how much is it priced? So yes, for all you Mumbaiker boy fans, followers, subscribers, uh, just DM me and I'm definitely going to give you your uh, discount code. So the online price, if you check on adjust, it's uh, 499, that's approximately 5000 for this device. But if you get it, uh, you will get a discount to me, through me. So please DM me and I will give you uh, the discount code. That was basically my personal experience with the adjust for the five months that I've had this device. I'm 
pretty pretty much happy and i'm of course you're going to love this device there are a lot of people using it go ahead and support it if you want the product yes dm me and i'll give you the code and of course i'll arrange that discount for you it is 5499 uh the uh, adjust maximizer is what you're looking at it has beautiful features go ahead and check that video on the installation where i've gone ahead and explained every feature of it so this is mumbai car boy saying thank you so much have a beautiful day if there's any questions leave it in the comments and guys who are new please subscribe like and spread the love this is mumbai car boy saying thank you and see you on my next video bye bye